Hello, am I audible now? Hello, students, am I audible now? Yes, ma'am, you are audible. Yeah, thank you so much. Just give me two minutes. Uh, headphone, I Okay, so uh, thank you very much for bearing uh, with me uh, and um, I welcome you all to uh, uh, today's uh, lecture. And as you all know, we are going to take economics. Uh, just give me two minutes, students. Am I audible now? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Thank you so much. Uh, I once again welcome you all to uh, the lecture on engineering economics. And as you all know, this is a two credit course. Right? And we are supposed to finish off two chapters in uh, engineering economics. Now, uh, you all must have heard or uh, read somewhere about uh, what economics is all about and how we are, uh, how economics uh, useful in our day-to-day uh, -day, uh, life. Uh, so uh, in this term, in the next four chapters, which we are going to study, uh, it will be a bird eye view of what economics is, uh, how economics is useful, especially now you are uh, engineering students uh, and technical students. So somewhere there has to be a link between uh, engineering students and economics. Now, when we talk about economic students, it considers uh, basically uh, about uh, decision making. Decision making in relation to what? Decision making in relation to uh, as a producer, as you, as a part of the government, as a part of the economy, right? right? And uh, when you when you talk about uh, yourself, let us take one particular student and here uh, see Ari. Now she cannot say that I am a student of engineering, so I will not be related to uh, the subject at all. Okay, so very good. Okay, students, decide karna padega, what am I going to do today? Okay, first, what should I do? What am I uh, supposed to uh, eat for the breakfast after my initial uh, daily routine? Similarly, you will have to decide what type of clothes are you, what type of transportation are you going to use in uh, your daily community, etc., etc. And all these decisions are somewhere related to your economic position. Right? If your income is limited and if you are uh, planning to have pizzas and burgers every day, somewhere that is that is going to lead to development. That is going to create problems for you. Right? Similarly, if you are a producer, I can give you example of stalwarts like Vijay Manlya running away from the country or Atani somehow be unable to match between his production, his distribution, his profits 
and his credit and had to leave the country. On the contrary, we have people like Tata, have people like Ambani, right? Who are who are getting stronger and stronger as year is passing by. The situation remains the same for everyone. Where is the difference? Some have been able to take the right decisions, whereas others have failed to take the right decisions at the right time. Right? But who is happy? Can we say that PJ Mahale is very comfortable? He has duped the country and he has run away from the country. Is he satisfied? He is happy? Comfortable? Answer definitely. Right? Similarly, the same uh, goes with uh, Mukesh Ambani. Right? There was a uh, there was a news that he is ready to hand over the reins to the next generation, and he's confident that the next generation is going to be well, or in fact, it will take the industry one step ahead. Right? So, where is the difference between these uh, people? The type of decision, right decision taken at the right time. And this is all what economics talk about. And it teaches that as a police, as a consumer, as a government machinery, as an exporter, as an importer, at each step you will have to take economic And what is that economic decision? Always the resources are limited. And the number of things you can do from resource is unlimited. I can give you best example. If you have 500 rupees at home. The number of things you can do from that 500 is innumerable. So to me, kya kar, wo sab kuch kar sakte hai, kya? So to me, kya karna padega? How can you take the decision, correct decision or incorrect decision? You will have to prioritize your work. Is what the most important thing is? Do it first. What is not important to do it. So you as a producer or as a consumer, you will have to arrange the wants, the needs, According to urgent. Ke khud ko, khud ke dimaag ko, ki aadat lagani ko. Ki kaun sa want sab se jada important hai? Kaun sa want jaduri hai? Right? Agar wo decision hi galat ho gaya, what will follow? Dissatisfaction. Right? Unhappy. Displeasure. So what each and every one, and it's not one time exercise. It's a regular exercise. It's a daily exercise. Or what what decision we take? Sir, put ka short term ke baare mein baat. Like, uh, let me again clarify with the help of us. You have five hundred, and tomorrow you have a test. Want to purchase a book? Correct. But with that five hundred, you can go and you can uh, while away with your friends. होटल में जाके खाना खा सकते क्या अच्छा सेल लगा है कोई ड्रेस ले सकते क्या कोई इलेक्ट्रॉनिक गैजेट ले सकते ये सब तुम कर सकते उस वक्त सबसे जरूरी क्या है तो सबसे जरूरी कल एग्जामिनेशन है अगर वो किया तो अगेन यू मे गेट मनी एंड यू गेट अदर थिंग ओके सो व्हाट इज इकोनॉमिक्स ऑल अबाउट Economics is first of all economics is a social science. Okay. What is what do we mean by social science? Social and science. What is science? It's a systematic study of something. So it's an economic system, but it is systematic of what? It is systematic study of human beings. Oh. Okay. What is that? What social science? Correct. There are two types of science. natural sciences and Social sciences. Natural sciences you have studied chemistry, biology, etc. All these come under natural science. Social science means economics, sociology, political science, philosophy, logic, ethics, etc. Whatever is studied 
with about society and about a uh, human being that is called the social now what is the basic difference how is the human behavior keeps on wavering okay keeps on changing every minute abhi tum kuch bol rahe ho kuch soch rahe ho next minute tumhara sochna aur bolna kuch to alag hai to isliye jo conclusions natural science mein milte hain wo conclusion definitely social science mein nahi milte So, so the basic difference between social science and natural science prevails. Natural science decisions are applicable always with the same intent. H two two hydrogen and plus one oxygen will be H two O. It remains same throughout the times, throughout the place. But the decisions taken by human being by one person can be applicable now, but non-applicable later. Okay. So their decisions are relative; they are not specific. They they can be generalized, but they cannot be exactly applicable as they are. That is what is economics as a social. Now economics is called as the queen of why it is queen of social science because it is the base of all the other social science uh, existing in the world okay because somewhere economics is related to money all those decisions which are related to money is economic decision is there that why economics important hai so first economics gives us uh, decision to choose this was talked about uh, talked by economics like professor jonan robins he said what is economic economics is a study of human behavior in relation to unlimited wants limited means which have alternative use so teen economic problems kya hai first economic problem hai tumhare wants kaise hai unlimited hai second kya hai tumhara means the sources Satisfy these wants are limited. Okay. Third, क्या है? सिर्फ limited नहीं है, उसको alternative use. Alternative uses मतलब क्या? अभी मेरे तुम्हें मतलब 500 का note है. वो तुम innumerable चीजों पे खर्च कर सकते. That is what is alternative. So each movement you will have some problem, and what is that problem? That is the problem of choice. You will have to choose. कि इसमें से सबसे इम्पोर्टेंट क्या है वो कर अगर वो सच में इम्पोर्टेंट है विल लीड टू सेटिस्फैक्शन अगर वो उतना इम्पोर्टेंट नहीं था तुमने सुपरफिशियली लिया था दैट विल लीड टू डिसेटिस्फैक्शन अनहैप्पी करेक्ट अगर वो अनहैप्पीनेस ऐसे ही एक्यूमलेट 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 आ गया एंड विल बी आई गिवन यू द फर्स्ट एग्जाम्पल विजय मान गया रनिंग अवे फ्रॉम दैट करेक्ट वॉट इज द रिजल्ट रिजल्ट इज अन Realistic or wrong decisions at wrong time, right? So the the way the way. One question here, when Lionel Robbins was talking about the problem of choice. So what what is the most important aspect of economics? Satisfaction. So satisfaction is the main thing. Who but then? If an alcoholist is there, he gets maximum satisfaction by drinking alcohol. Correct. So, what is the most urgent need for that alco uh, alcohol is to drink alcohol. अगर उसने किया हो, तो उसको maximum satisfaction मिले. Okay. So then it was being questioned. But then is economics right? Is economics correct? Then the next step came welfare economics. At any time, if an alcohol takes the decision of drinking alcohol. No doubt he is going to get maximum. But in the end, what will happen? 
उसका इफेक्ट उस फैमिली पे होगा उसके खुद के ऊपर होगा सोसाइटी के ऊपर होगा अगर एक ही सब पार्ट बना रहा है तो उसको ज्यादा बना In this way, stage by stage, actually the economics kept on developing. First came Adam Smith, and then came Marshall, and then came Lionel Robbins, who talked about uh, the problem of choice. Or abhi tak wo bahot the problem of choice has only been accepted as the main um, definition. Of so the moment, what I want to tell you is very simple. The moment I start talking about economics. What is what are certain concepts which come to your mind is more important. What is economic satisfaction? What do we mean by satisfaction? Okay, why uh, sat uh, uh, satisfaction is a feeling of content, feeling of happiness. अच्छा लगना चाहिए. And again, it's a relative concept. Quantify नहीं कर सकते satisfaction. पर कितना satisfaction मिला ये बताने लेकिन वो सेटिस्फेक्शन को क्या कर सकते हैं वी कैन मेजर इन टर्म्स ऑफ प्राइस मतलब क्या अगर एक चीज तुम्हें बहुत अच्छी लगी सपोज यू लाइक अ पर्टिकुलर ड्रेस व्हाट डू यू डू सेकंड थिंग व्हाट डू यू आस्क इज प्राइस अरे वो प्राइस अब तुम्हें लग रहा है वो ड्रेस कम से कम 2000 का और वो ड्रेस तुम्हें हजार रुपये में मिली तो तुम क्या करते हो तुरंत ले लेते हो द रीजन इज योर ओपिनियन was high quality of the product is high but you are getting at a lower price lekin tumhe lag raha tha ki wo product 1000 rupaye ka hai to coat karta hai 2000 right what do you do bage kitchi ke 1500 mein do 1200 mein do correct aisa karke agar it doesn't doesn't work out you leave lekin agar work out to tumhara bhi nahi mera bhi nahi 1400 mein do 1500 mein do kya hota hai वहां पे तुम क्या कर रहे हो वो आरफेक्शन इफ यू आर रेडी टू बाई द प्रोडक्ट आर गेटिंग प्रोडक्टिस्फैक्शन इन अदर वर्ड एनी यूटिलिटी तो आई इंट्रोड्यूस वन मोर कंसेप्ट इज कॉल्ड एज यूटिलिटी In economics, everything is related to utility. So, as a producer, as a consumer, क्या करने वाले हो? जो वही चीज करने वाले हो या वही decisions करने वाले हो, which will lead to satisfaction. As a producer, when will you be satisfied? Only when you get maximum profit. As a consumer, when will you get satisfied? then you can purchase maximum products with minimum money or whatever resource you are having so jyada se jyada agar tum goods and services to usko bolte hain you have achieved maximum satisfaction and this problem the problem of maximum satisfaction remains whether you are an individual whether you are a family whether you are a society whether you are a company You are, you are an individual as a consumer. You are an individual as a producer. You are a government machine. कुछ भी होगा तो भी वो problem जो है वो exist होता है और वो problems का right decision तुम्हें लेना चाहिए आना चाहिए. 
तो इसलिए इकोनॉमिक कि वो एक तो तुम्हें क्योंकि इनकम हमेशा लिमिटेड ही होने वाला इनकम कभी भी अनलिमिटेड नहीं है क्योंकि जैसे जैसे तुम्हारे इनकम बढ़ते जाएंगे उसके साथ साथ क्या बढ़ने वाला है तुम्हारे नीड्स टुडे व्हेन योर इनकम इज लेस योर पेरेंट्स आर हेल्पिंग यू टू लिव यू आर मैनेजिंग विद द बेसिक कि जैसे जैसे तुम खुद पैसा कमाने लगो तो तुम्हारे कुछ ना कुछ तो सपने हों और जैसे जैसे तुम्हारा इनकम बढ़ते जाएगा वो सपने बड़े बड़े होंगे तो सेटिस्फैक्शन के लिए क्या इम्पोर्टेंट है इनकम इंक्रीज करना इम्पोर्टेंट है क्या हो सकता है लेकिन उससे भी ज्यादा जरूरी क्या है जितना भी इनकम अर्न करते हो उससे यू शुड बी एबल टू सेटिस्फाई योर वॉन्ट्स शुड बी एबल टू सेटिस्फाई योर नीड्स पैसा कम नहीं पड़ना चाहिए क्या कमाते हो वो इम्पोर्टेंट सो This holds true for everyone beyond rules, beyond time, beyond place. Whether you are American, whether you are Indian, African, या कुछ क्या करने के लिए आना चाहिए हमारा income इतना है वो income में how many goods you are going to satisfy, which are going to give you that. हमारे पास कुछ resources हैं वो रिसोर्सेस यूज करके क्या प्रोड्यूस करने वाले हो दिस इज मैक्सिमम प्रॉफिट और वो मैक्सिमम प्रॉफिट मिलने के बाद वो प्रॉफिट को डिस्ट्रीब्यूट कैसे करोगे प्रेजेंट कंजम्पशन के लिए कितना रखोगे फ्यूचर कंजम्पशन के लिए कितना रखोगे जी इन्वेस्ट कितना करोगे दीज आर द डिसीजंस व्हिच एवरी इंडिविजुअल हैव टू टेक स्टेप बाय स्टेप ओके सो व्हाई डिसीजन हैज टू बी टेकन देयर आर टू थिंग्स फर्स्ट यू नीड सेटिस्फैक्शन Second, the things at your disposal are not unlimited. Not limited. If the money is unlimited, then what do you need to think about? Where do you need to spend money? How do you spend money? So the second most important problem for any uh, country or any person, individual or anyone is scarcity. Scarcity means Lack of certainty, less of certainty. But demand is more. Supply is less, but demand is more. That's why we have to make every step we have to make a choice. If it's less, we have to use it. 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 There are two things which are hard of the subject. One is it now. One is Satisfaction and second the scarcity. Similarly, there is the the third most when we talk about economics, I am talking in two perspectives. First, I am talking in the perspective of an individual. Okay, and second, I am talking in perspective of the entire group. अगर individual के तौर से मैं देख रही हूँ, तो I am talking about my group. M I C R O. I'm talking about micro. And if I am talking about entire group, then I am talking about macro. Okay, very, very. Today I am just going to use all these things. Then tomorrow I think we can uh, discuss uh, these things. Okay. So microeconomics and macroeconomics. You can go ahead and you can read the definition of. Capacity of choice. We can read a uh, definition of uh, welfare. We can read Adam Smith, how he started talking about specialization, uh, how he started talking about division of labor. Very uh, in his uh, first book of the Talk Nation. Okay, and then you can read about what is microeconomics and macro, the definition and difference. Uh, study uh, tomorrow. Uh, so what we are going to In the coming term, we are going to first study about microeconomics, which will uh, give you 
various things which are studied in microeconomics. So, as an individual, to make a decision, they might take. As a consumer, to make a decision, they might take. Yes, of the microeconomics. So, what are you doing? If you want to do goods and services, then you can do goods and services. So, you can do goods and services. Where do you produce? Where do you take decisions? I think microeconomics will uh, definitely help. There is something called as a uh, market structure. That uh, let us talk about geo. Correct. When geo SIM card came into uh, the market, there were many SIM cards exist. Prevail. Correct. They are. Airtel, Vodafone, there was n number of idea was correct, and there were many others. Hutch was there, and some other like I don't know, Chinese something, Pakistan something, etc. But in the day, 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 Vodafone and IDEA have merged and there is GIO. Correct? So, slowly kya honne laga? Competition jo hai among the number of firms which are producing the commodity kept on speaking. So, just to produce as a producer from a corporate world. So, yeh sab to me decision. Which is called as a market structure. The microeconomics will also tell you what is market structure and what are the decisions taken when you are um, operating in a market structure. Producer, what do you have to do with the consumer? That is taught in microeconomics. And microeconomics is very important as well. Macroeconomics, what is the problem? शेयर मार्केट्स कैसे डेवलप होता है? तुम शेयर मार्केट में पार्टिसिपेट करने के लिए क्या करते हो? What do you mean by brand? पैसा कहाँ से आता है? पैसा मल्टीप्लाई इकोनॉमी में होता है। लोन्स के लिए कंटिन्यूअसली जो रूल्स एंड रेगुलेशंस चेंज हो, वो कैसे चेंज? All these are important parts of market. That's it. सब इंटरेस्ट, सब बढ़ता है। Yes, so what application? All this is a part of macroeconomics. Microeconomics on one hand gives us a political formation. Macroeconomics is a political formation. Why are these decisions? What is political? Inflation. What do we mean by inflation? What is the effect of it? Why inflation is bad for us? The consequences क्या होने लगा? Economic norm. ये सब हमें macro economics से पता चलता है and Indian economics से पता चलता है कि where at present is Indian economy in comparison to the rest of the world? Comparison with the developed countries and correct where do we stand? That we come to know with the help of macro economics. जैसे माइक्रो इकोनॉमिक्स मैटर है, वैसे ही और एक मोस्ट इम्पोर्टेंट है इंटरनेशनल। व्हाट इज इंटरनेशनल इकोनॉमी? द रिलेशन ऑफ वन कंट्री इन टर्म्स ऑफ अदर कंट्री। तो व्हाय व्हाय द द रेशियो और द रेट ऑफ एक्सचेंज वन डॉलर सेवेंटी how it keeps on changing? Why sometimes it's 71, 75, sometimes they have reached me in 1990, that reached to 40. On what basis is this rate of exchange decided? How, how does it vary? Why does it vary? This is uh, taught in international. So we will be. We, we will try, we will not be able to uh, discuss each and every thing 
uh, related to economics. I will try and cover as many aspects as uh, possible. In this. There will be certain things which I will be using. And uh, every day after every lecture, we will try and uh, at least for five, 10 minutes, have any doubt. Uh, I will keep posting uh, all my PPTs on our. Uh, now I will uh, I will ask one of B, whoever is the CR of the class or uh, group leaders to form a WhatsApp group and include me in that WhatsApp group uh, so that uh, communication gets uh, easier among us. Okay. And. Uh, Anything else you want to ask or uh, you want to talk about, we can talk. Uh, Ma'am, uh, uh, please tell us about evaluation pattern. Evaluation pattern remain test one. I think to be taking next month will be test one. You must have all got uh, your uh, academic calendar. So test one, test two, at least test one, uh, I think because of COVID, we will be having online examination, so it will be MCQ. And I include certain questions, which are theoretical questions, which you will have to write in the, uh, write and then you will be scanning and putting those questions on uh, the Moodle. Okay, that will be test one. Test two will be there. I think test two again will be. Let's see how the things proceed. If they offline, hai, then the paper pattern will be uh, different uh, for test two. But if it is online, then it will be mixed of MCQs and theory. And then the uh, end will be the semester examination. Again, depending upon uh, the COVID situation and your online or offline courses, uh, the end semester paper pattern will also change. So at present, two tests and one end semester examination. Last time for the end semester examination, both the things were taken. Uh, online uh, test was taken and then we had orals. Judge, judge the subject knowledge. I will suggest you one best uh, thing students make the things. Last time students had lots of difficulties or uh, whatever uh, due to online business. I will suggest you uh, best thing to follow my PPT and follow my lectures. If you follow my lectures, most of the test, most of the syllabus I try and cover in the lecture itself. There is no, uh, I don't miss out any. And my test papers are based most on my lecture. Uh, you can keep a notebook and whatever like term of maintaining regular notes. To be class me you are not going to read. I don't think so. There will be any student who will be reading every day something extra related to it. Subject. You should read newspaper. You should try and catch up what is happening in day to day. Uh, the thing. That's a totally different uh, question. But follow the lectures thoroughly. Pay attention to the lectures. Wherever doubts, ask and clarify your doubts. That is the best way. Keep yourself updated and go to mark. So two tests and one end semester. And I'll keep posting the PPT on uh, of each lectures. I keep posting the PPT on the on Moodle. You have all registered yourself for the Moodle. So please uh, put your uh, attendance also. Anything else? Otherwise, for today, we can uh, stop the lecture. Okay, then see you then. See you tomorrow at 4 o'clock.
थैंक यू मैम थैंक यू मैम